The Novette 6x2 Ultra HDMI Matrix Switch with PIP, ARC, AEF, and SPDIF support. Also known as a really cheap way to add a lot of HDMI ports to your TV. Alright, so what is this box from a brand that you've probably never heard of? So long story short, I got a new TV, which I have not reviewed, but the fact that I don't review TVs is a video for another day. So anyways, I got the new TV and it has three HDMI ports, but I have a lot more than three devices that go into the TV. So I needed a cheap solution that would let me plug in all of my devices without A, having a million cables, and B, without having me to unplug a million cables to switch between all of my different devices. So I went on Amazon and took a long look at all the different options between straight HDMI switches, full-blown receivers, and everything in between. I finally landed on the Novette because it was cheap, it had 6 DMI inputs and 2 HDMI outputs. Not that I really needed 2 outputs. In fact, why would anyone need 2 outputs? What am I going to do, have 2 TVs and run an HDMI cable across the house so that I can use both outputs? I guess I just would have rather had 7 inputs and 1 output, but I digress. Beyond the number of inputs, the price and the rest of the device is pretty solid. Easy to control remote, obvious buttons and schematics, a setup does not really even exist because it's essentially just a pass-through box with a remote. It also looks nice, sleek, and professional. It's nothing amazing, but it's not an eyesore sitting on or in your entertainment center. So I got it all set up, all my devices plugged in, and I've been using it for a few weeks now without any issue. The time between switching inputs is pretty much nothing, and I have noticed no degraded image quality running through the box. So really, what else is there to say about it? It works as advertised, it's cheap, and it really has very few problems. I would honestly say the thing that is the worst about this product is the IR remote or the IR receiver in the box itself. You have to point the remote pretty directly at the box, any variation really causes it to not work, and it's kind of annoying, but really, is that too much to complain about? And that pretty much wraps it up. If you are in need of more HDMI ports and you want to spend a small amount of money and have a completely solid solution that will work consistently and simply, this is a really good buy. However, having said that, there are probably a lot of similar products that are close in terms of feature and price. There is nothing amazing about this product, just a solid HDMI switch that works great. Anyways, if you guys liked the video, please consider subscribing or leaving a suggestion for a future product video down below. Anyways, later guys.